Found on the second floor of the cathedral's west towers, this small doorway marks the entrance to the clerestory level. Specifically, this is the door that will get us the closest we can get to the creation rose window and begins the walkway of the clerestory level, a tiny, narrow walkway that encircles the entirety of the cathedral's interior at a height of about 65 to 70 feet off the ground. This is absolutely one of my favorite places in the entire building. Let's take a look. This segment of the clerestory walkway runs directly under the west rose or creation window. More than 10,500 pieces of glass make up the creation rose window, designed by Rowan Lecomte and installed by Dieter Goldkula. Few visitors are able to gain this unique perspective on the building, although it is accessible on our behind-the-scenes tours and on private tower climbs. From this vantage point, you can look down the full length of the nave, running one-tenth of a mile from the doors here at the west end of the building, all the way to the high altar at the far eastern end. Looking up to the vaulted ceiling, you can see boss stones running the length of the nave, which use stone carving to represent the Nicene and Apostles' creeds. Directly over the west balcony are boss stones representing the Ten Commandments, including the cathedral's largest boss stone, Moses holding the two tablets, which weighs five and a half tons.